we've been working with the community for seven years to create a transformation of the landscape in Falkirk in the project called the Helix and the Kelpies are the pinnacle of that project in terms of transforming the landscape for the community. The Kelpies are the largest equine sculptures in the world. Uh, they're 100 feet high and they dominate the landscape. The partners uh, were Falkirk Council, Scottish Canals, Central Scotland Forestry Trust and Big Lottery. The Kelpies were constructed using stainless steel and they took about nine months to be constructed and they were built in Yorkshire and then transported in sections up to Scotland. Well, Andy Scott, of course, said he was inspired by the working horses that used to go up and down this canal bank and also the, the working horses, in fact, that worked for people like Bars, actually Bars Iron Brew, uh, was first made here in Falkirk. The 360,000 visitors that we've welcomed to the park over the last uh, four months has really shown how people have taken them to the heart. And this has begun to transform this area. People from all over the world now visit here along with the Falkirk Wheel. And this is therefore an asset, a place to enjoy for local people, for people uh, across uh, the United Kingdom and indeed across the world. People are stunned by them, confused by them. They want to know what happens below the ground, how they got here. So there's a huge amount of different experiences that people have. Mainly people are just in awe of them. The Kelpies have really got their magical feel and I think people really make a connection with that. It's well worth seeing and a great credit both to the artist, the, uh, the sculptor, and to Falkirk for, for placing them here. They appear out of the landscape and they provide a really good focal point for people coming to Falkirk. And they're a real inspiration for people to come out to the outdoors and experience a soul invigorating experience here in Falkirk. People really do see it as a placemaking state a statement of ambition, a statement of transformation, a statement of renewal and bravery about the future and we're delighted by that.